So obviously we have a DC, DC wall. We have a DC wall. Um, so first, to the right. What I wanted to do, and it's still a work in progress all the time, is that on the right on the left, the shorter walls, we have um, our boutique companies, right? So some smaller companies that are not mainstream, so to speak. We put them, we showcase them first. So this right wall is what we're gonna talk about first. Um, we have some of our, our low budget Buffalo 10s. Uh, we have some of our house blends there. We partner with different companies uh, to bring non-label cigars, which I've been heavy into uh, on this right wall. Uh, and then right behind, right here, we wanted to bring in our humidification where we change that. Humidification is key when it comes to cigars. Uh, once the humidor reaches a certain level of humidification, that'll come on and it will blow out mist. Um, so it's piped into our water line. Uh, on this main wall right here, we have some of the mainstream, we have yes. Drew Estate. We had to put definition there just because we have like 10 facings of there, yeah, these I'm guys, I'm and the DC that. logo. <laughs> these guys, guys. Yeah, these guys are pumping out sticks. They're pumping out sticks. Uh, we have our CLE, which is also our asylum line. A lot of people know about them. We also have uh, Agonarsa Leaf. Real quick. This right here, you did not warn me how fire no, this fire. stick is. Yeah. Uh, we smoked this on, I smoked this on a DFWCA okay. meeting early okay. in the morning and did not know. Yeah, that no, it was that's not gonna, an early morning. No, it's mm. not. No, it's not early morning. Yeah, from start to finish. AJ Fernandez, um, anything AJ you cannot go wrong with. Uh, our top shelf, before we get to our backstop, we have some of our Placencias, yes. Miquiera, um, some of our Crown Heads, um, some of the premium, premium, premium tobacco, uh, Oliva V, uh, anytime we can get a hold of uh, Velvet, anything, Velvet Rat uh, with, with Drew Estate, we have that right here on this, this main shelf. Uh, and then right here, again, we have Boutique. Boutique companies, and they might not they consider. Are, are cruel. Yeah, the Crux. They Crux. might not consider themselves boutique, but up and coming, right? So we wanted to bring Crux in. Some of the sticks that we bring in, we wanted to make sure that on this side of town, the south side of Dallas, that um, these cigars were not made available. And so, again, traveling around in different cigar lounges, I wanted to do my homework and, and see what cigars they did not have, and I wanted to bring those in. I see there's a Gloria's in there, too. Yeah, yeah. Those yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Don Rafa, we brought them in. This is the, the uh, Volcano. That's the new uh, 2021 stick that they brought in. So this is some of their premium blends. And then also, uh, we have the Arrival. Uh, which is Ken Hamlin. Shout he, out to the Hamlin. Yep. Yeah. Ken Top Hamlin. Top five favorite cigars right uh, there. And I want to correct something. So Don Rafa did one year. Ken Hamlin did the second year anniversary. Um, he came in. He actually lives in Houston. Uh, but his cigar is super complex. He has four countries in his, his, his cigar. Four tobacco. Four tobaccos. This right here is the, um, the, Grand, the Grand Toro. All right, so it's a six by uh, six by fifty-eight, I believe, six by sixty. Um, and then right behind cuff, we have our flavors. Uh, so right now, our flavors are exposed. Any flavors that are overpowerful, we want to put them in the front, out by themselves, so that they won't take over the humidor. But any of our flavor cigars, uh, we have Espinosa there. Some of our back stock, we have some of uh, Drew Estate's flavors. DC has flavors. Uh, Espinosa's there, and then the traditional Tatiana's, the Cuban honeys. If you have not had them for six dollars, coffee. Know. If you drink coffee, try that truffle. Try the truffle. And then Don Rafa, because they showed so much love to us, we have three of their skews there, uh, specifically in the vanilla cognac, the chocolate mint, and then the raspberry champagne. Actually, the raspberry champagne is what brought me back into the company. So. Uh, in the future, as we grow, <laughs> as we grow our revenue, in the middle we want to have either two six, <laughs> uh, two six foot tables where it's tiered and we have tobacco in the middle so you're kind of walking in this circle. We also want to put shelves on this lower side. This cedar right here, you guys, if you don't know 
anything about cedar, but it's, it preserves um, the humidity of your, your tobacco and your cigars. We want to put shelves there and we want to add, add to that as well. This POS system, we want to have a POS system that we can ring you out here and we can ring you out there. So that's it. Yeah, that's what. Members? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Got to love. So is this sponsored by Cavalier? Not yet. You better speak into existence. Mm, so, come on, man. This is our members' lounge. If you see the windows right here, you cannot see in. I am going to turn the light on once I go in. You still will not be able to see in. Um, the people that have come in that we've allowed in to see this, they ask, is Cavalier sponsor? We're speaking into existence. I don't care who sponsors it. Put the name on. Yeah, I don't care who, but this, this is who we targeted over the last six months. Um, they've done a great job with us uh, relationship wise, but I'm going to go in. This is our members lounge and excuse it because it is still under construction. It's all good. So excuse it. Actually, the light is on. The light is on. So this is our members lounge. Uh, right now, we just have one TV up on that, that side right there with your projector screen. Uh, that we'll put on the red wall. The red wall, I'm a pop girl, so pop colors. I uh, wanted a pop color on that wall. We'll have TV here, projector here, and this will be our members lounge where they can do business, hang out, be by themselves, whatever they want to do. Yeah, we have fridge for them, Coke Sprite, whatever they may need. They want to house any of their liquor, anything in there, they can do that. It's a place so yeah, can. thank you so much. So some of, some of the pictures here, I want to show this. Some of our members, uh, Ralph, who's been great to us. We got Ty, we have Dom. Had to make sure I put Espinosa up here. Um, pictures on this side, my guy, my partner, Jacoby. Uh, we also have Ken Hamlin, who's been great to us with the arrival. One of my staffers, uh, he's there. And then again, Espinosa. So hey, Espinosa, if you want to sponsor the lounge, we're with it. Come on now. We're with it. Espinosa, where are you? You can sponsor this. So along this 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 brick wall right here, we'll put our pictures. Some of the pictures that people have seen in our other lounge, we'll have that up on that, that wall for them. I love it. Thank you for the tour. It's uh, been amazing, super proud of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's been great. Thank you. It's been great, 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 Thank you. great. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Y'all stay tuned in to the Vision Lab podcast each and every week, every Tuesday at 1130 Central Standard Time. Blessings. <laughs>